Hello, I'm Sharon Phillips. Here's a look at some of today's top stories from 2 News Oklahoma. Lawmakers are mourning the loss of Oklahoma's longest serving Republican state legislature. Congressman Tom Cole confirmed that State Senator Charles Ford of Tulsa passed away at 90 years old. In a statement, Congressman Cole said, quote, Charles Ford was a visionary Oklahoma leader who served our state in his party with distinction, honor, integrity, and great professionalism. He was the greatest Republican legislator of his era and probably in the history of Oklahoma. A TPS elementary school is closed today for the second day in a row. Leaders at Hawthorne Elementary announced Tuesday night that school would be virtual on Wednesday because of a shortage in staff. That shortage now has the doors closed today too. No word yet on whether that closure extends to tomorrow. You can download the 2 News Oklahoma app and we'll keep you up to date. Well, yesterday, the Tulsa City Council approved an employee vaccine stipend program to help increase COVID vaccination among city employees. Employees who are fully vaccinated by October 15th will get a $250 stipend. And starting in November, departments with at least 70% of team members vaccinated will receive an additional $250. Now let's get a check of the forecast. You can take a look right there and see our seven day. It's going to be hot all week. Uh, 90s pretty much throughout the rest of the week with 80s on Sunday. And we are expecting a little bit of rain on Saturday night. So you'll want to watch out for that if you are headed out to the OSU football game. But the rest of the week looks like it's going to be starting to cool off hopefully soon. So grab your umbrella on Saturday if you need it. And that is a look at some of the stories making headlines today. You can stay with 2 News Oklahoma for updates throughout the day. I'm Sharon Phillips. We hope you have a great Thursday.